Hello friends, welcome to another episode of Phantom Paranormal. I hope everybody's doing great today. Uh, Steve Huff's coming out with a new box. There's already a Wonder Box out there on the market called the Wonder Box. But he's coming out with his own version of a Wonder Box to let everybody know that is pre-recorded speech in reverse of elderly women, elderly men, uh, young men, young ladies, uh, young boys and young girls, etc. Uh, he's saying that that will give them the option to choose uh, what voice they want to represent uh, themselves with. Now I'm sure it's going to be a fascinating app, but for someone with my mindset, when I first heard about it, I got a little upset because it seemed like it was awful soon to be coming out with this after the research I'm doing. But I moved past it really quick because I realized that the Wonder Box he's putting out, all you got to do is go visit his site and it'll tell you all about it. If the spirits can choose through that app, if they have the ability to choose how they want to come through, it begs the question and, it, and you can't get around it. It begs the question, can it or can it not make them more deceptive? I'm just saying. I mean, really think about that. Thank you, guys. Thank you very much. Is Steve's Wonder Box going to make evil spirits more deceptive? Thank you. So you can have a demon or an inhuman spirit come through and sound like a little girl, sound like your grandma, sound like your grandpa, sound like your dad, sound like a little small little sweet innocent girl. Um, I'm on the fence about that app, personally, and it's not even out yet. Because we all know spirits are already, some of them are already rather deceptive. And we all know that they can be deceptive. And what my goal is here, I've been trying to do is hear their actual true voice finally coming through via more effects. So I'm kind of on the fence again uh, with it simply for the fact that if anybody knows that spirits can be deceptive, he should know that. Thank you. I mean, he's been attacked, and uh, so he should know how deceptive they can be. So he's giving them another tool 
to be more deceptive with. Now that's just my opinion. That's just my opinion. Everybody has the right to their own opinion. Of course I'm going to try it and see what comes through. I'm honest. I will try it. It just begs the question. If it gives the, the entity the ability to, to choose its own voice and represent its own voice the way it wants to, to me it just seems like it gives the ability for so much more deception that we don't need already in this field. So what my research is doing is I'm trying to bring out their real voice for a change. I'm trying to make it crisp and clear for a change. Um, I'm, I've got spirit voices coming through that weren't coming through before. Um, thank you. Using all these effects. And to me, it's just mind-blowing and incredible. Thank you. Apparently, my friends agree with me. So, I'm sure it's going to be a very cool app, but ask yourself, just ask yourself one question, does it give them the ability to be more deceptive? That's all I'm asking. That's all I'm asking, that you... Ask yourself that. Is his new app that's coming out going to give the spirits more easier ways to deceive us? Possibly demons can come through as little girls or your grandma. We don't want that. I don't want that. I don't think any of you guys want that. Um, so I'll just leave it at that. They, they're already can be decept deceptive as we already know. So it's a catch-22. But I don't think they're all deceptive, but it sure is going to give the ones that are deceptive a hell of a lot better chance to be even more deceptive and even more evil. That's just my opinion. What do I know? I don't know. That's just my opinion. Just my opinion. That's just what my brain tells me. What? Don't turn it off, guys. Come on now. Don't mess with me. All right, guys. So with that, thanks for tuning in. I just wanted to tell you about it. They're testing it right now, and it will be coming out probably in a couple of weeks. It just begs the question, does, does it give spirits a chance to be more deceptive than they already can be? I don't know. I'm just on the fence about it. 
because they can already be so deceptive. Alright guys, well, speaking of free apps, I think, uh, let, me, let me look here and see what I want to use tonight. <clears throat> I haven't used this one through here. It's an oldie but a goodie to me. And basically, the white box you seen that I used, the platoon, there's one called the platoon box. It's basically the white box with a different skin, from what I can tell. Uh... I'm going to give the old free spirit box by Spotted Ghosts a chance and see what comes through. Hello, hello, friends. Personally, I'd rather hear their real voice. How are you? Everybody, everybody having a good night? I hope so. What do you guys want to talk about tonight? How many is here tonight? Hey Mike, what's your name? Nice to meet you. So tell me, are any of you in hell? Are any of you in hell? Thank you. Would you light up the lights if it's possible for, for us to save you once you're passed away? If you're already dead, can we help your spirit? So if you've already passed away, 
is it possible for us to help help your spirit move on? Okay. Are we are we supposed to do that? No. Can you tell me why we can't? Just a question. Are any of my friends, girlfriends here tonight? Thank you. I felt you. I knew my, my ladies were around. Can you tell me some of your names, ladies? I said, I said names. Okay. That's good. Are you are you safe? That's that's good. Satan. Why do I keep getting Satan? Try to come through one at a time. Just heard a F me. I can't do that. <laughs> Is Carol around? What about em what about Emma? You're good?
Thanks for coming through. All right, guys. That was the old SG. Spotted ghosts. I'm gonna try the old PS SB2 from Spain Paranormal. Hello everybody. How is everybody? Everybody having a good night? So what's your name? Salud. Gloria? Hi, Gloria. I'm Michael. How many is here tonight? Hiding. You don't have to hide from me. Can you say you're dead? Thank you. Can any of you mind telling me how you passed if it's not too troublesome for you? Heart? Okay. I'm sorry. I appreciate you speaking with me tonight. Who's the oldest spirit here tonight? I'll tell you what, guys, me and Austin get the nastiest spirits sometimes. Females.
How are you ladies tonight, by the way? Do you have a message? Do you have a message for mankind? If you can hear my voice, would you let out a scream? Thank you. Thanks for coming through. All right, guys. We tried that box. I know the old wolf is cheesy looking, but I like the box. I got to be honest. Hello, friends. accidentally did something with that one so I'm gonna move on past it let's use let's use Shack Hack from Steve Houlet and see how that comes through here. Hello, everybody. How is everybody? Everybody having a good night? If you can hear me, if you can hear me, could you let out a scream? Say five. How 
how many ladies are here? Eight? How many of my girlfriends are here? Ten? That's a pretty good number. Alright guys, well thanks for talking, can you say goodbye? Say bye bye. Alright guys, thanks for watching this episode, and I'm going to be trying a bunch more apps, and I'm going to be getting out the old PSB7, and running it through FM and AM tonight, uh, just to see what happens. Thank you for lighting up the lights so much. I guess they want me to use the PSB7. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, take care of each other and take care of yourselves.